Behind every woman, there is a fact. Behind every gender issue, there are many facts at play. IOM's Displacement Tracking Matrix, DTM, collects and analyzes facts and trends that help us devise solutions to challenges unique to women and girls on the move. Pudimos identificar, bueno, pudimos encuestar a unas chicas trans y ella nos decía y nos pudo dar con los detalles pues todos los, los retos y todas las dificultades que ha tenido y la discriminación por el hecho de ser trans que, que le, le causó durante el viaje y que fue una de las razones por las cuales ella se, se tuvo que, que ir de su país de origen. Entonces, bueno, este, esto eh, pudo direccionar un poco las actividades en el hecho de atender específicamente los riesgos y las vulnerabilidades de la población LGTBI, específicamente las personas trans. Y ella me decía, pues sí, durante todo el viaje me he sentido muy mal y ahora se viene y me encuesta y me hace sentir un poco mejor, porque sé que esta información le va a ayudar a otras en el camino. Creo que el DTM es una herramienta muy útil para poder conocer cuáles son los, eh, los retos que enfrentan eh, las mujeres o distintas poblaciones porque nos permite conocer cuáles son sus necesidades, tener este acercamiento de saber no solamente en, en números de cuántas de mujeres o cuántas personas de la comunidad LGBTI están entrando, están viniendo, sino también cuáles son sus características, ¿no? cuáles son sus necesidades en específico, de, sabiéndolas directamente de, de ellas, ¿no? de, las, de las personas. Yesterday I met with Miriam, uh, one of the young ladies staying at the reception center. She's a 23 year old and she has a child of her own. Um, she fled her hometown in Chinene, which was under attack by the Boko Haram, and came all the way on foot with her own child uh, to Puka. And she just told me that she feels much better uh, staying in one of the shelters with uh, her child. Lors de la résurgence de la maladie à virus Ebola en mars 2016 à Koropara en Guinée forestière, les données de la DTM ont permis d'identifier les zones de mobilité et de vulnérabilité. Des postes de contrôle sanitaire ont été installés au niveau des zones de vulnérabilité avec l'appui des agents de suivi des mouvements de population. From our service, we know that almost half of displaced women in Ukraine have higher education. However, the situation with their employment is much worse compared with men. Among displaced women, only 48% are employed, while among displaced men, 73% have found a job at the new place. Knowing about all the income challenges faced by conflict-affected people in Ukraine, IUM has been running an economic empowerment program for them. We provide business training as well as grants for vocational courses and equipment. In the male-dominated society of Afghanistan, gender inclusion and gender equity are major challenges. But still, women's voices need to be heard and women need to be included. In uh, DTM's uh, data collection activities, this becomes a very difficult challenge indeed. Uh, when we first started in January of 2017, we only had uh, nine women included in all of our surveys. It's out of 7,000 individuals interviewed, and we had zero female staff. Through DTM's active recruitment of more female staff, we've been able to reach more women in the field to include in our surveys and in our focus groups. DTM teams work closely with partners to collect information on gender-based violence, counter-trafficking and child protection that can be used to address the protection issues facing women and girls. Data collection tools like DTM help us measure the impact of the assistance being provided to displaced people and support accountability. While addressing gender-related issues, we make sure that the solutions are underpinned by data.